name is Mateo. And we are the storytellers of Plaza de la Familia! We are happy to see you here today as we celebrate the heartwarming story of Coco. In this wonderful story, a 12-year-old boy named Miguel sets off on an extraordinary adventure to the land of the dead, where he unlocks an age-old family mystery. Miguel's journey begins in Mexico, where he lives in the small town of Santa Cecilia with a very big family. And he shares a special bond with his great grandmother, Coco. The Rivera family are proud shoemakers. A tradition started by Coco's mother when her husband left home to become a famous musician and never returned. Since that fateful day, music has been banned in the Rivera household. No music! Now, Miguel loves his family and he respects tradition. But deep in his heart, he has a secret. He doesn't dream of making shoes. No! Miguel dreams of singing and playing the guitar. Just like us, his passion is music. Ah! And this song that Miguel sings tells the whole
can't forget the charismatic de la Cruz, especially on Dia de los Muertos. The day of the dead is a special time when we gather to honor family and friends who have passed on. We create an offering, a memorial altar for the party loved ones. We set out photos, flowers, candles, and a path of miracles to light their way home. And so, it is on the eve of this family holiday that Miguel discovers a foreign photo, which leads him to believe that his erratic great great grandfather is actually Ernesto de la Cruz. What? See, si, Ernesto! Miguel runs to his family and he joyfully announces, I was born to be a musician! But his family is outraged. No music! And his abuelita smashes his guitar to pieces. Heartbroken and angry, he runs off to Ernesto's grave. He finally grabs the musician's guitar and strums it with all his might. Suddenly, Miguel finds himself crossing an enormous bridge of miracle pedals that takes him into the land of the dead. A magical world where no living person has ever been.
you continue to enjoy Plaza de la Familia, a celebration of Coco and the everlasting bonds of family here at Paradise Gardens.